Film star Cagney Lynn Carter dies by suicide at 36. Friends mourn Cagney Lynn Carter's passing, launch memorial fundraiser. Famous adult film actress Cagney Lynn Carter has tragically passed away at 36 after taking her own life. The heartbreaking news was shared by her friends online, and TMZ later reported her death by suicide on Monday. According to the website, Cagney died at her residence in Parma, Ohio, on Thursday. Her friends posted a heartbreaking GoFundMe page with a moving ode to the celebrity, confirming the circumstances. Unfortunately, despite all of her many impressive accomplishments and talents, Cagney struggled with mental health issues as the years passed by. Following their plea for support to assist Cagney's mother Tina with the expenses for her memorial, her friends took to social media to raise awareness about her health battle. They also mentioned that any excess funds raised would go toward supporting an animal rescue. He GoFundMe page creators for Cagney's mother said, We are fundraising on behalf of Tina, Cagney's mom, for the cost of Cagney's memorial and all financial expectations associated with it. Who was Cagney Lynn Carter? As per her friends, the 36-year-old was a performer, a singer, a dancer, a daughter, and a friend. She first came to our Cleveland studio in November of 2019, freshly moved out of L.A., rearing and ready to jump back into pole, in a brand new community where she knew no one and no one knew her. Cagney made her debut in the adult film industry in the middle of the 2000s, and her talents brought her numerous AVN awards. In 2019, she made the decision to relocate from Los Angeles and return to her love of pole dancing, eventually becoming a regular at an Ohio studio. She eventually decided to open her own studio, focusing on the beauty and athleticism of pole dancing instead of adult films. Her friend on the page added, even in her darkest days, however, she still showed up to the studio, always ready to learn, contribute, better herself in whatever small way she could manage.